XFL. Let's ball out, baby! Well, that is hype man and XFL co-owner Dwayne Johnson kicking off the new season of the revamped football league, the XFL. In 2020, Dwayne Johnson and his business partner Danny Garcia teamed up to buy the XFL. And this past weekend, they debuted the new version of their league with excitement from fans all across the country. Well, they're going to join us now from Audi Field, home of XFL's DC Defenders. Good morning, Dwayne and Danny. Dwayne, way to, way to, way to slide in there right at the last second when we're coming to you. It's, <laughs> <laughs> it's great to see you both. Welcome to GMA. And, I, and I don't know if Dwayne can hear oh, me yet. So, so Danny, I'm going to start with you. What a what a big Great. weekend. What a really big weekend Sorry. for you both. You launched this league. Uh, you guys were present at games in four different cities. So uh, how was the fans' reaction to, to the first games of the new season? I've got to tell you, it was overwhelming. Every city was just better than the next. And the fans, they were so ready for this. We came out, the love they had for their teams, for the coaches, the excitement, it was palatable. It felt so XFL, and uh, it was amazing to actually be connecting with them. It was amazing. And, and, and Dwayne, we know that you, you were a football player in college. You had the potential to be a pro football player. Didn't quite work out for you. Do you think that your life path, your career, maybe you're not who we know you are now if the XFL existed back then? Do you think that's a possibility? Michael, w without a doubt, uh, I, I wish, Danny and I talk about this all the time, I wish that I had the XFL when I was coming out of University of Miami. You know, you and I, Michael, have talked about this a lot, which is football was my dream. Football was the ticket. Football was going to be our ticket, uh, our way out. And I worked extremely hard. I was so incredibly lucky to have Danny support me the whole way, continue to push and motivate me. But that was the dream. Football was the dream. And as you know, and as many people out there know, there are 53 men on an NFL roster. I was always number 54. Mm. DJ, you're good, but you're not good enough. And so that mentality of number 54 has stuck with me and stuck with us. Put a chip on my shoulder. It's still there. You can see it now on live TV on GMA. But it's the that mentality of player 54, uh, the hunger, the drive that that creates, uh, that permeates not only ownership, leadership, but also that's what the entire league is. So all of our players who have who proudly wear a different number and a different and, and a different last name on the back of their jerseys. Michael, they're all player 54. And that's why this league for us, the XFL, is so incredibly meaningful and, and it and it goes deeper. It goes much deeper. And that's why fans would notice you always wear number 54, the jersey, when you're at the practices. And, and speaking of ownership, Danny, you're making history. I mean, you're the first woman owner of a major sports league. So, so what did this weekend mean to you? You know, this, um, I gotta tell you, I get a little emotional <laughs> when I talk about this weekend. It's the culmination of a young woman, a young girl, dreaming big in life, getting to a moment in her life later on as a mature woman with great partners and being so moved by a sport she loved and saying, I want to buy the XFL, and gathering great people around me and our, and our partner, Jerry Cardinal at Redbird Capital and our XFL football ops team, Russ Brandon, the entire team, and having them all collaborate and, and join this vision. And while that was happening, I made history. I didn't set out to make history. I set out to launch a league with great partnership and, and do something spectacular for our athletes and our fans. And to look up and have this moment in time be pivotal, it's amazing. It's, it's, it's awe-inspiring. It, it drives me to be better every day to make sure this is not just a moment that happened, but this is the beginning of moments that'll happen. So what? thank you so much for asking. As, you, as you see, Michael, I've just got to say, you know, I have, I have the proud privilege of being Danny's partner in this thing. And it, I always like to say it was the easiest yes that I've ever said. Uh, three years ago, March of 2020, she called me and said, hey, I've got a big idea. It's kind of crazy. And I said, well, don't threaten me with a big idea. She goes, 
let's buy the XFL. And she couldn't get the L out before I said, I'm in. And the opportunities that we've been able to create. And on top of that, Danny making history. But you're both, again. You're it's both special. making history. And we'll see you guys soon. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.